because the numbers themselves weren't spectacular. They were kind of ho-hum when you back out the one-time deferred revenue recognition, they had a low tax rate. So I was like, okay, well, the gross margin was 24 and people look for 26. So I thought, you know, at best the stock might be flat. But then, you know, the conference call, what they what they told people was that the orders for January were about twice what the production was. That's huge. And, you know, when they were talking about their their guidance for the year, which I didn't think they were going to guide, they, they stuck to the 50 percent long term production growth, which I didn't think they would do that. Uh, and then, they, you know, Elon started hinting, well, we actually could even do two million, which, again, if you try to do the math, you don't get anywhere near two million based on what they're saying. So I think what people are going to come away with is that they're pretty confident that their price cuts are working. And I think what you have to see the street do is, you know, take the volume estimates up. But, you know, the gross margin numbers for me, they were much lower than I thought they'd be. So I'm probably going to wind up taking my estimates down a little bit just because I got to bring gross margins down some more. If I take my numbers down to, say, 23, I'm down to about 480 in earnings. But the street is below 450. And, you know, you got you got to put this calculus together that, you know, volume should go up, but margins, gross margins should go down. And I think at the end of the day, you will see some street numbers go down because the quality of, of the earnings was not great. I'm surprised the stock's up, but they were so confident on the call about volumes, unless they're not telling the truth. Um, you know, it, it came off as a pretty good call. I mean, my partner said to me, you know, he saved it because the numbers were not anything to write home about. But he was so confident about volumes that I think everybody said, wow, that, that must be pretty good if they actually think there's a chance they could get $2 million in volume in 2023. Because I, I don't have a number anywhere close to that. I know the streets at like 185. I mean, everything about the actual earnings release itself was kind of mediocre to even slightly negative. But, you know, the conference call was, was really good, even though Elon, you know, stumbled around a little bit.